Hello everybody! I'm back and I'm actually going to teach you how to make um, channel um, custom thumbnails for your videos. And uh, so we're going to use the same program as I did in my channel art tutorial. Um, if you haven't seen my channel art tutorial, you should check it out because it can probably give you a lot of um, information. We're going to go back to that website called pickmonkey.com um, and we are going to go to edit again and uh, to pick out a blank blank download. I'm going to pick out my Galaxy one once again. Uh, the thing with um, the difference between the channel art and this one is with the channel art there was a template that was there for a recommended purpose and would allow you to have the exact size and width of the banner that you needed with custom thumbnails you don't need to really worry about that too much unless your picture is extremely large so this one is decent um, since this is a thumbnail this will probably be a relatively quick video um, all you need to do is this is entirely free to do um, for those of you who do not know already PicMonkey is free and um, you just put your picture on here, you pick a background, so I picked the galaxy, I just googled the picture off the internet and I saved it in my downloads and then I opened it with this website. Um, then you go down here and you can go to text, which is what I clicked on right here. And I'm going to start with text for my thumbnail. Um, we're going to go with something fun, just because, you know, it's fun to create a... Um, channel art. So let's go with something fun. Um, once again, for those of you who don't know, the crowns mean uh, a royale member, and those you usually have to pay for. So please try to avoid those if you're trying to go the free way and um, not pay any money. Um, let's see here. Let's see here. What's fun? What's fun? Go like Super Smash Brothers one. Um, let's see. Let's see. Um, what's this one look like? You could do the hearts. That'd be cute. Uh, I thought that said cock block for like two seconds. Um, okay, let's let's try flavors. Let's see what flavors does. Um, we're gonna do channel art tutorial. Highlight it. Sometimes you have to highlight it and then reselect what you had before. not feeling it. Let's go. Oh my goodness. I'm sorry about that. Um, let's see. Green fuzz? Nope, that sounds, that looks scary. I don't want scary. Okay, I'm back. I decided to go with Luckiest Guy. Um, and I made the font extremely big. I'm going to actually lower it just so the so tutorial can be seen a little bit better. Um, and so I made this extremely large because most of my, um, my temp, my, uh, bleh, I keep wanting to say template, um, my thumbnail is going to be just this. I don't have really any pictures, um, typically speaking, uh, like when I do a Mad Father, I'll do characters from the game or something like that, and then I'll put part one or part two, but since this is a one thing, uh, I'm just going to do this. Um, as far as overlays go, I'm going to see if I can get some kind of cool, crafty, drawy kind of a thing. Um, do this little scribble thing. I think that looks kind of cool. We could put that there. Um, these are all overlays, by the way. You can just go through and find them and just put them in. Um, they're relatively kind of cool. I'm 
And I'm just trying to make this look as artsy as possible. I really don't have a specific um, theme going here. Um, I know that uh, doesn't really matter, but I know for some it can get really like intense and like a lot of people put a lot of time into theirs and um, and so this one it's just supposed to be creative and funny, you know. So I'm gonna make it creative and funny. Um, correction marks. Hmm, that's kind of cool. Bottom line, paper scrap. Banners, engraved banners. Well, that's really pretty. I might use that on a different one. <laughs> uh, throw a button in there, maybe. That would be kind of cute. Maybe put a button down here. Button somewhere. Button, button here. Yeah. Okay. Well, this is where I'm, this is about as far as I'm gonna go for this one. Um, I'm gonna save it. save this peers because it's a usually a good like midway to, of a quality you can go to and um, so yeah so that's that but if you're a gamer like I am and you have series of templates and and series uh, not templates uh, okay if you have series of games that you play that are more than one video long you may want to go with something different so what I do is I have a template we're gonna go with my mad father because that one's the one that I've worked on so I have a template that I've already created I have already saved this picture I added those characters in and I wrote mad father using these things over here now if I want to make another part then I just simply go to text I select the text that I want to use so in this case we'll just do an aerial because I know this is one I don't normally use but we'll just do an aerial since it's simple and then I just type in in the box part 1234 <laughs> just for fun and uh, I can just position it like so. Whoops. Bold it, make it bigger. And there you go. And you can just change it up. Just keep adding like and then if you save the template, so if you go through and you you make this and you save it as a template, then when you go to Pick Monkey, you can just keep adding the parts at the bottom and you don't have to worry about remaking all of this the next time. Um, I did that for um, all of the Mad Father ones, I just added the part at the bottom. Um, even for the um, late night, same thing. Just added the number in. It's very simple to do. You just save it and then you put it towards your video in the custom thumbnail area. So I hope this tutorial really helped you and I hope you can use it. And um, check out my other stuff. Check out my um, channel art tutorial if you haven't already. I hope that this helped you and I hope to that you guys liked it and I will see you later. Bye!